What's going on today guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we got our first kind of real snowfall here in November up in Canada. My wonderful girlfriend here, she just got her G2 license. I know she's a little late bloomer on the driving, but she has never driven in snow before. So I thought today was the day to give her a little driving instructions and a little driving experience in the snow in my Ram 1500. Um, I think it'll be a cool little video um, seeing her reaction to the snow, what it feels like to be in two-wheel drive versus four-wheel drive, and maybe we'll even get her doing a couple little power slides, get her the feel of the truck and uh, the feel of the snow. So, I think it'll be fun. We are in two-wheel drive. We got a little cul-de-sac here. Chelsea's ready to rip. Let's see what happens. <laughs> All right, now there you go. Now touch the accelerator a little bit, get the back end to come out. Whoa! <laughs> See, isn't it fun? <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> See, now this is why two-wheel drive in the snow is kind of crappy because if the roads are slick, like they are right now. All right, I'd slow down. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, she almost put us in the freaking ditch. We're like a hundred meters of driving, she almost put us in the ditch. Jesus. You didn't tell me what to do. She's a wild woman, <laughs> my god. Oh Jesus. Oh gosh. Oh baby. Is she gonna make it over the little bit of snow here? God, she's on the city road. Oh my gosh! This thing's sideways. Oh, oh, oh. oh she is a... <laughs> oh! Christ, she's gonna wreck. Okay, so we're gonna try and really get this truck to spin. Chelsea's first spin here. So, yeah, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna follow my tracks in there and then just come all the way around. And then once you're kind of like halfway in, just put some throttle to the truck and then the back end should flop around and then you can kind of steer out of it, right? It's almost like second nature. It'll, you'll just, you'll steer the- Oh yeah, okay. No, I'm serious, but yeah. Okay, okay. You got this. And then we'll do some four wheel drive stuff. All right, boys, my, my truck could probably wreck this time. I don't know. <laughs> I'm thinking there's not too much stuff in the way. If it does go wrong, maybe we end up in the bushes, minimal damage, maybe in a fence, minimal damage. I don't know. But we'll see what she's got. See if she can spin the truck a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh. Take your foot off the throttle. Get going a little bit. There you go. And then yeah, just spin her. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah, there you go. See, isn't it fun? Look at that smile. Oh, she thinks I'm stupid because I like doing that, but then she smiles. <laughs> All right, at least she knows how to kind of slide the truck and she got a feel of what it feels like to for the truck to slide and the ABS to come on and all that fun stuff. Um, but now, oh my God, I killed myself. <laughs> Holy <laughs> I almost ended up in the hospital there. So I'm gonna get her reaction, what it feels like to be in two wheel drive versus four wheel drive. I think it'll be kind of night and day for her. So that should be a fun reaction. So we'll see what happens. So just the roads are really slick. We're going really far. Okay, so. <laughs> now, we're gonna put in four wheel drive lock. Okay. Oh, I moved! <laughs> I know, isn't it a miracle? This is steadier. Is it steadier? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to be, steadier. 
All right, we're back in intersection. We're at a little bit of a slope here. We're back in two-wheel drive. So we'll get Chelsea try and uh, turn out of here in two-wheel drive versus four-wheel drive and get her reaction. All right, go. Oh yeah, just spinning. Oh, now we're in four-wheel drive lock. All right. Pretty night and day, eh? I like it. This is why people like to have four wheel drives when they're driving in snow, because it makes a world of a difference. Uh, well, uh, we ended up uh, kind of in the ditch. Uh, it's a good learning moment. Uh, no harm to the truck, no harm to property. Well, maybe a little grass here and there, but. Um, this is why I wanted to take her out in the snow so she could learn how the truck reacts and if you overcorrect, like what happened right there, um, you end up in the frickin' ditch. <laughs> Thankfully again, it's early in the season, there's no big snow banks, we'll be able to get this no problem. Hopefully. <laughs> it's too bad I wasn't filming, but... <laughs> Chelsea! What do you have to say for yourself? <laughs> you said give her some throttle. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. All right, well, we got to get out of here somehow. You're still in four-wheel drive, I think, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll come over to the side. <laughs> oh lordy, lordy, lordy. All right, well, yeah, um, keep the wheels straight. So straighten the wheels up a little bit and then put it in reverse and just back her on up. Try to anyways. Yeah, keep going. There you go. See? Nothing to it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> wow, God, we got some grass damage there. Uh-oh. All right, after that exciting snow lesson, Chelsea has decided she doesn't want to drive anymore. <laughs> so we'll call it lesson one, many more to come, but uh, I feel like it was somewhat productive. <laughs> and uh, hopefully you guys found that somewhat entertaining because uh, I did. The snow is just gonna keep on falling for the next, uh, I don't know, four or five months here. So we're gonna have a lot more fun upcoming. And my Eaton True Track diff is going to come someday i don't know when but apparently one day it'll be here and we'll throw that in and have some fun so as always if you like the video don't forget to leave a thumbs up and if you like cool stuff like this maybe think about subscribing we'd love to have you on board but that is enough of me we'll see you in the next freaking video